music and spirituality. They are tied together. I, I really don't think you can separate spirituality from music or creativity from art. And here's why. I'm a firm believer in, in the beginning, God created. And the book of Genesis tells us that when God made us, when he made humanity, he made us in his own image. Well, what does that mean exactly? Well, God is the master creator. He's the master designer. He is the master artist. God is an artist. I mean, look around. He's an artist. And he made us in his image. He made us to reflect him. He made us to be like him. So when we create, when we take an idea or we take uh, inspiration or a feeling, something that is formless, and we bring it from our spirit through our hands or through our voice and into the real world to make it something tangible that has form, something that we can actually share, that we can gift to somebody. That is all the divine creative process. It's a reflection of the creator creating something out of nothing and bringing it into the physical world. And the beautiful thing about music and creativity is that it is not only creating, taking something and bringing it into the physical world, but it's still spiritual too. So it has both spiritual, a spiritual nature and a physical nature. I'm so grateful and so thankful to be able to be part of this process. When somebody shares with me that my music touches them, when it helps them to get through a difficult time, when it helps them through loss, through suffering, when it brings them through darkness, when it brings them joy, when it inspires them. This is all an act of God. It's all a gift from God. And I just to be able to be part of this, to reflect this aspect of who God is, to be an artist in this beautiful world. I'm just so thankful and so blessed. And I love that my music can help people have hope because there is hope. And there's beauty, and there's joy, and every moment matters. It's all grace. It's all God's grace. I'm so thankful. <laughs>